Understanding in Jeopardy, a guide to English idioms. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating English phrase, in Jeopardy. This phrase is widely used in both casual and formal contexts, and understanding its meaning and usage can greatly enhance your English comprehension and expression skills. Let's dive in. In Jeopardy is an idiomatic expression that means being in a situation of danger or risk. It originates from a French word meaning game or play, but in modern English, it's used to describe a circumstance where there's a threat or a significant chance of loss, harm, or failure. For instance, if someone's job is in jeopardy, it means their job is at risk of being lost. This phrase can be used in various contexts, personal situations, when personal well-being or relationships are at risk. For example, after the argument, their friendship was in jeopardy. Professional contexts, in reference to jobs, projects, or business deals. For instance, the company's future is in jeopardy due to declining sales. Legal and environmental scenarios, such as when talking about endangered species or legal rights at risk. While using, in jeopardy, it's important to remember. It's typically used in serious contexts. Avoid using it for trivial situations. It should be used with the verb, to be, as in, is in jeopardy, was in jeopardy, etc. Don't confuse it with similar phrases like, at risk, or, in danger. While they are close in meaning, in jeopardy often implies a more immediate or severe risk. Let's look at some examples to understand its usage better. 1. Environmental. The oil spill has put the local wildlife in jeopardy. 2. Personal. His poor health put his career in jeopardy. 3. Legal. The lack of evidence put the case in jeopardy. I hope this video helps clarify the meaning and usage of the phrase, in jeopardy. Remember, Learning idiomatic expressions is a great way to enhance your understanding of the English language and sound more like a native speaker. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to use, in jeopardy, in your conversations where appropriate. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.